ready for flight. Drivers behind the line. Three, two, one, go. All right. Plenty of fuel cells being shot over on the blue side. As we enter into teleoperator mode. Drivers have control of the robots. Everybody's moving here. Advantage red. Each alliance with one rotor spinning. Here comes the second rotor for red. Pilot gets it spinning and there it goes. Winnovation shooting some more of those fuel cells toward the boiler. Looks like they got to get that calibrated a little bit better. A few of them going in. So working out the kinks. They've got one KPA for those balls that they did shoot in. Meanwhile, over on the red side, they do have two rotors going. They're working on the third one now. And they've got all four gears in place. That's the third gear spinning. So almost a 100 point lead for the blue for the blue or the red alliance. Although blue now gets a second rotor spinning, cutting it down, but it's still a good lead for the red. We're coming down toward the end of the match, about 35 seconds. putting up some more of those fuel cells. With the blue lines, they're up to two KPAs. And now as the rope, as we're in the end game, the robots are trying to hang. Getting ready for flight. Two red robots up in the air, a third one trying, and all three of the blue ones trying as well. Five seconds to go, all three reds are up. One of the blue, two of the blues, and oh. The third blue robot just runs out of time, just a little too low to get that hang. Final score coming up, and it's the Red Alliance. The score of 305 to 197. That's gonna be two ranking points for the red team. That third hanging blue robot would not have made the difference in that match.